as streamers still somehow make money on kick, documenting what fatherless behavior looks like, this guy from Arizona is still bothering Japanese citizens by stopping a subway by standing in the doorway. Bothering old men in the streets. Why you say that? Because I'm, I'm black. We like that. We have big lips. I don't care your black or white or yellow, man. But curiously, when he encounters younger, more capable people, this shoe-sized IQ crew flees the scene. Oh, he's calling. We gotta get out of here. He's calling. Where's he going? Go. Who the calling? And when he runs into other foreigners fed up with his antics. And what? And what? And what? I'm more Japanese right now. Why are you mad? Why are you mad? Why are you mad? I'm talking to your homie. I'm not talking to you, bro. Bro, it doesn't matter. You don't have to be My homie is the same. Go, go. Enjoy your night, bro. I don't want to kill nobody tonight. Go enjoy your night tonight. It's impossible. You're not going to kill nobody. Ain't nobody can say we want to let him do this. Who the f are you talking to? Yo, yo. I'm talking to you. I will absolutely smack this. Now he actually took a shot here, does nothing for several seconds, but then gets bold when people step in for him. Who are these? I'm gonna run up on this right now, bro. You wanna? Yo, stop playing with me. I'm about to beat the. So maybe that's why he wants to go after girls like this Twitch streamer, Meowco. We don't like Twitch streamers on K. Okay, then we're we are not talking. And then turn around. Yeah, bye bye. Bye bye. Get banned. Get banned. You don't get banned for me. Yo, yeah, you better walk away. <laughs> I'm a dick. I'm so sorry, guys. Today, I really wanted to have a really great stream. But finally, he runs into another foreigner that does what his father never could and shows him that some people have their limits. Okay. Hey, you, you, whatever, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, yeah. All you have to say Don't is grab nothing. Uh, oh. Uh, and curiously, they aren't acting so bold anymore. So sadly, this was 1 million percent predictable, and at some level, I think the streamers knew this was bound to happen as well. And yet, after all the warnings they received from the authorities, the Yakuza, and other foreigners, they simply could not help themselves, as they literally have nothing else to offer society, other than being this walking, progressive jackpot. Where in places like Las Vegas, there's these slot machines that have jackpots that increase whenever somebody plays, but doesn't win. And with these streamers that do nothing but ruin society, the only draw they have is people patiently waiting to see them find out live. Because the scary part is, how many low-level IRL streamers are out there right now that are literally trying to make a name for themselves in a sea of streaming obscurity by hitting the jackpot that is being Japan's biggest hero since Mechagodzilla. But after he went after Meowko, trying to get her banned on Twitch, she wanted him banned on Kick as she took to Twitter to explain how she wants him out of Japan completely. And luckily for him, he has finally been banned off Kick. where if his ban is permanent, this will likely hurl him into a world of poverty as it doesn't appear he has any other profitable skills. But honestly, I think this ban is literally going to save his life. As even though I'm a big proponent of freedom of speech, I also identify that doesn't give you freedom from consequences. And just because he makes content online doesn't mean consequences won't find him in real life. So if you appreciate my concise, light order commentary on the tragic status that is today's reality, hopefully I've earned your subscription, then go check out the video on how blue-collar working men don't tolerate unemployed behavior.